were doing was, this is supposed to be difficult, it wasn't supposed to work every single time, and then you guys are supposed to come back here and say, well, what do I do if I can't turn block and lock? Two and one, two. Well, here's the thing. First thing I have to do is, I want, to be, I want my shoulders on his shoulders. I want my shoulders on top of his shoulders, my chin on his spine. Way too many of you have your shoulder on his spine. That's big trouble. I know a lot of people can score from here, but the problem is, it doesn't give you as many options. You can be great in there and score against almost everyone that way. But if you meet someone who shuts you down from there, you have no secondary option. You have no plan B. So what we're trying to do is wrestle from a position that gives us the most options possible. Not the best way to score, it's the best way to give us options to score. Because one way to score is not good enough. So shoulder to shoulder, chin on the spine, my opponent right here is working hands. Notice how I'm on my toes. Too many of you guys were on your knees. So he's working hands. It can't work. So as he's working hands, I'm putting pressure on him, and I'm making adjustments with my hand. And the harder he works on him, the less he's not really concentrating. See what just happened right there? You see what just happened? I'm working, I'm working to get my lock. He's fighting me. I take my left knee and I come over here. The second I take my left knee and come over there, he lets go of my hands and he starts wrestling against my leg. As he starts wrestling against my leg, that gives me a chance to turn his chin. That was kind of the idea I was hoping you guys would get to on your own. If I'm wrestling in here, he's working on my hands. But as soon as I start wrestling him and I'm trying to come behind him, he's going to start changing his idea of how he wants to defend now I should be able to turn his chin. Chin on the spine, shoulder to shoulder. He's working hands. I'm starting to come around. He broke my grip. Now he lets go again. I get to turn his chin. One more time. He's fighting hands. I'm working. I'm cutting here. I'm trying to go behind him. I'm working again. should be able to find his chin. He's going to fight hands until he thinks you're going behind him. When he thinks you're going behind him, he's going to fight you from going behind him. When he leaves you alone, find his chin. One, 